Then with people telling us about fake NFL tickets being sold, we're asking the experts about how to spot a fake. ABC 15's John Erickson is live in Tempe where the Cactus Bowl is underway right now at Sun Devil Stadium. And uh, John, we're all ears. Well, Stephen Katie, I talked to a scalper who's been buying and selling tickets for 35 years. He says you usually won't see a scammer out here for a game like this because that only happens when uh, the average ticket's going for about 200 bucks. Here with uh, Oklahoma State taking on Washington, the average ticket's only going for about 20 bucks. But he says even he got scammed. Someone sold him fake tickets for the Cardinals' last home game. That was when Seattle was in town. When I get tricked, and I've been doing this for 34 years, when you can sell me bad tickets, you're good. I'm not a fan. You're good when you can sell me bad. He says what he should have done but didn't do was take a picture of the seller, that person's driver's license, and if they have a car nearby, take a picture of their license plate. That way, if the tickets are fake, police have a way to track down the scammer. He says he was out almost 600 bucks because he bought those fake tickets. And he says, guys, usually the fake ones that he's seen at least have been on Ticketmaster stock. So if you are buying tickets from a scalper and their Ticketmaster tickets, be especially wary. He says as a scalper, he'd be more than happy to have a buyer take his picture and a picture of hmm. his driver's license. Some tips with that big game just around the corner. Yeah, the forgeries are getting so good these yeah, days. Exactly. Thank you, John.